Hey guys, it is the Coaster Battleman here bringing you the five most iconic coasters at Cedar Point. And this is a tough list to make, but I feel like these rides here that are honorable mentions just didn't seem to be the ultimate the ultimate iconic coasters of Cedar Point. Magnum really is a really good skyline dominator by the water park, but in most of the park, it, it really does feel like it's hidden. Dragster, it is hidden, but if you're in the midway, anywhere in the main midway or in the Gemini midway, you can easily see it. And if you're in the very back, in Sandusky, you can see it. Maverick, it's small, so you can't really see it, but it really does dominate the area it's in. And Iron Dragon has a nice iconic moment where it goes over the water on Cedar Point Lake, which is something pretty cool. But here are the five most iconic coasters at Cedar Point, in my opinion. Number five is Valraven. This is a very iconic coaster, and from the beach you can even see the first drop of Valraven, which is awesome. This coaster really does dominate the skyline of Cedar Point, and is a very iconic coaster with that awesome color scheme it has with brown track and blue supports. It's just a pretty iconic coaster with that opening drop. Number four is Millennium Force and this coaster is tall, fast, and long and it does dominate the skyline due to how tall and fast it is. Be me meaningly how tall it is but Millennium Force, my number one coaster, it's very iconic. May not be the most iconic coaster at Cedar Point but it really is an icon at Cedar Point, and you can see it from a lot of places in the park, in the middle of the park. Number three is Corkscrew. This coaster you may not see too well because it's so small, but in the area it, it is in, it's awesome. Like from the hotel breakers, you can see the ride going through the double corkscrews, which is awesome, and the vertical loop as well. From Power Tower, you can watch Corkscrew. From Top Thrill Dragster, you can as well. Like, the area it's in is awesome. That's why Corkscrew has made this list. Number two is Raptor, and this ride dominates the main midway of Cedar Point. With the compact layout it has, plus, Val plus it just got a new repaint for 2016, so it really does pop out. So, Raptor, very iconic coaster, and I'm happy it recently got a new color scheme, so now it pops out even better than it used to do. And number one is Gatekeeper. This is a fairly new roller coaster at Cedar Point, the second newest ride, or roller coaster at Cedar Point. And this coaster, its layout just makes it dominate the whole skyline in the front of the park. With the main entrance, you can see the whole keyhole towers just towering over the main entrance plus the color scheme really is awesome and it pops out it really does fit and overall gatekeeper is probably the most iconic ride at cedar point some could argue millennium force or magnum or top thrill dragster or any any of these other rides but in my opinion gatekeeper really is the, the most iconic ride at cedar point Thank you for watching, stay tuned for more videos.